السلام علیکم آئی مریم بی بی سیونٹین ایریو ٹو ڈبل نائن زیرو فرام ہارٹی کلچر ڈپارٹمنٹ کورس کوڈ فائیو زیرو فور اینڈ کورس ٹائٹل سمر ویجیٹیبلس آئی ایم ہیئر ٹو ڈسکرائب دی پروڈکشن ٹیکنالوجی آف بیٹر گرڈ وچ از اسائن ٹو می بائی ڈاکٹر تنویر حسین فسٹ آف آل آئی ول انٹروڈیوس بیٹر گرڈ وچ از ون آف دی پاپولر ویجیٹیبل ناٹ ان انڈیا بٹ آلسو ان پاکستان اٹ از پاپولرلی نون فار اٹس میڈیسنل نیوٹریشنل اینڈ ادر ایکسیلنٹ ہیلتھ بینیفٹس Because of its high demand in the market, bitter gourd farming is done very successfully. Bitter gourd is mainly used for making juice and for culinary purpose. It has health benefits such as it helps in preventing blood disorders, detoxifies blood and liver, boosts immune system and helps in weight control. The soil required for bitter gourd farming should be sandy loam which is rich in organic matter. Good drainage system is ideal for the bitter gourd cultivation. The pH of the soil ranging from 6.5 to 7.5 is best for bitter gourd farming. For bitter gourd farming, well prepared land is required. To bring the soil to fine tilt, 2 to 3 plowings should be done followed by weeding. The time of sowing for bitter gourd is February to March or June to July. Sow seeds on both sides of 1.5 meter wide beds and use plant to plant spacing of 45 cm. 2.5 to 3 cm deep seeds are sown in the pit. Dibbling method of sowing should also be used for sowing seeds. Use seed rate of 2.0 kg per acre. Before sowing, seeds are soaked in 25 to 50 ppm gibberellic acid and 25 ppm boron for 24 hours. Fertilizer requirement for bitter gourd include urea 30, 30 kg per acre, superphosphate 125 kg per acre and muriate of potash 35 kg per acre. Nutrient requirement for bitter gourd farming include Nitrogen 13 kg per acre, Phosphorus 20 kg per acre and Potassium 20 kg per acre. Application of farmyard manure at the rate of 10 to 15 tons is done before 10 to 15 days of sowing. Full dose of Phosphorus and Potassium and one third dose of Nitrogen are applied before seed sowing. The remaining dose of Nitrogen is added after one month of sowing. After sowing, first irrigation should be given. In summer season, irrigation is given after every 6 to 7 days and in rainy season, irrigation is given only when needed. In total, 8 to 9 irrigations are required. Intercultural operations are carried out for weed control. To control the weeds, 2 to 3 hoeing should be done in initial stage of plant growth. Weeding operations should be carried out in the soil at the time of fertilizer application and mainly earthing up is done during rainy season. Diseases and their control include powdery mildew and downy mildew. The symptoms of powdery mildew are appearance of white powdery spots on upper surface of leaves which causes leaf withering. Spraying of carbendazim at the rate of 3 gm per liter is done to control the powdery mildew. If infestation is observed for downy mildew, spray of mancozeb or chlorothal Thalonil at the rate of 2 gm per liter is done twice at the interval of 10 to 12 days. Depending upon season and variety, the crop is ready to harvest in 55 to 60 days. Picking of fruit is done after the interval of 2 to 3 days. Bitter gourd can be transported to local vegetable markets and herbal companies and finally to end consumers directly. So, plant your own bitter gourd. fearlessly and confidently thank you so much